Well, hopefully there is a sensible judge in Texas that will strike down this law that allows police to uh, arrest anybody they suspect of being an illegal immigrant. The uh, Biden administration in Texas will face off in federal court this morning over a controversial state immigration law. Shannon is here this morning with a preview. Yeah, Brandon, the ACLU and the Department of Justice are suing Texas in an effort to stop Senate Bill 4 from becoming law. Yesterday, outside the governor's mansion, immigration rights advocates dressed as Mexican wrestlers in protest of the law. SB 4 passed last November during a special session. It would allow law enforcement to arrest and remove anyone suspected of being in the country illegally. Once in custody. So that means they can just target anybody they don't like and suspect them of being an illegal immigrant and then either detain them and question them or arrest them or whatever and do whatever. It's a very discriminatory law and it will be used and abused. Custody immigrants would either be sent to Mexico or prosecuted for a misdemeanor charge. Opponents say this new measure could lead to racial profiling and civil rights violations. They say it's the federal government's responsibility to enforce immigration law. Republican supporters of SB4 say that's the problem, and they believe the federal government is not doing its job to secure the border. Constitutional law attorney David Cole discussed the case on Good Day this morning. The Texas position is, well, no, we're trying to help. We're not trying to write new laws. We're saying that state people, state enforcement officers, can enforce basically the exact same thing just under state law. We're trying to help you. If a court rules in Texas's favor, the law...